Hey guys, thanks so much for stopping by my channel. I'm not really rocking the voluminous hair today. We are in the middle of a heat wave. It's about, it feels like 40 degrees Celsius, which I think converts to about 102 or 3 Fahrenheit. So it's pretty hot. And I was like putting my hair extensions, I was like, oh, I can't do it. Super excited for today's video because it is a collab with one of my bestest friends, Melanie, from Mr. Kong's Mom here on YouTube. I know a lot of you guys know who she is because I do talk about her frequently. She's just she's just one of the best people I've ever met in my life. We met through YouTube and there is not a single day that goes by that we don't spend talking to each other. She's a mom, I'm a mom, we have a lot in common, we both obviously love makeup and YouTube and she's just, I'm just so thankful to have met her. Um, but aside from that, she has an amazing channel. She does mostly beauty reviews, but she also does a little bit of like home fragrance candle sort of reviews as well. So if you're into that, she is an amazing person to check out. I just think everyone should be subscribed to her because <laughs> I just love her to pieces. So today her and I are going to be doing a collab and we're going to be talking about our top 10 makeup products that we use year round because we were talking about doing a collab and we we're like well summer's coming to an end but it's kind of early for fall and I was like why don't we just do products that we use year round. Things that you can purchase and know that you can really get use of throughout the entire year. So that's what we're going to be doing. So we each picked 10 products. We didn't tell each other what the other picked, so I'm really excited to see what Melanie's picks are. Um, and we each decided to do nine makeup products and one fragrance. So, all right, so let me get started with my foundation pick. You guys are like, oh my God, can you stop talking about this? But I can't, sorry. The Rimmel Lasting Finish 25 Hour with Comfort Ser Serum, can't talk. Skin Perfecting Full Coverage Foundation. This stuff is amazing. You can find it at the drugstore. It's affordable and it works so well. Now, the reason that I'm talking about this as a year-round product is because I only purchased this in the last couple months, but I've been wearing it all summer, which is really strange for me because usually I'll just reach for a BB cream or a CC cream, but I have been reaching for this a lot. I've been getting some blemishes around my chin and that sort of stuff, and this just looks so natural. So I have been wearing it a lot this summer. Sorry, I like chose on my own. <clears throat> That's gross, never mind. It's not heavy, it's not cakey. I don't know what it is about this, but it's like magic. It just blends into your skin so seamlessly, and I know that it, I will carry this through to the fall and winter months because it is a full coverage foundation. It also wears all day, doesn't settle into fine lines, pores, and it doesn't break down. It also has a pump. I just love this foundation and it's just one of those products that will seriously do you all year round. My friend Jen, who was here last week, she's actually going to be in my next video that I post on Friday. Um, she had this in her makeup bag as well. She's like, yes, absolutely love this. So I know I'm not alone. Good stuff. Moving on to a bronzer, and I know bronzers are a personal thing depending on your skin tone, etc. But I picked one that I think will work for everyone, sort of. Okay, let me explain. So the one that I love year round is the Too Faced Milk Chocolate Soleil. It's a matte bronzer and for fair to light skin girls like myself, it's just the perfect color. I have it on today. That sun's a little bright, isn't it? Hopefully that's a little better. I have it on today. I use it as a contour. I use it all over just to bronze up the skin. Um, and I'm actually about two shades darker than I usually am right now. I know. I still look like a ghost. This, this still works amazingly for me. So this is just a great everyday bronzer if you are light to fair skin. It doesn't look muddy, it doesn't look orange, it just looks natural and it, it just really warms up the skin. So the reason I picked this one is because Too Faced also has the same product available in a medium and dark tone. Okay. So here is the milk chocolate, which is what I was saying works well for my skin tone. You've also got the regular chocolate soleil, which I have used in the past and made it work with a light hand, but this just is so much easier if you have that lighter skin tone. Chocolate soleil will work really well if you're in that medium range, and if you're in the deeper skin tone range, dark chocolate soleil is available as well. So it's the same bronzer, three different shades. I just think, you know, there's something for everyone there, and it will just work for you all year round. Next up, I have a highlighter, and I am a highlighter fiend. I freaking love highlighters, and I, I, I will admit I probably overdo it a little bit some days. I just can't get enough of that, like, strobing glow thing, you know? Um, but the one that I do reach for the most, and I mean like all year round, have bought it multiple times and will use whether I'm just running my kids to preschool or to the grocery store or I'm going out on a date, whatnot, is Hard Candy's Tiki. 
I just think it is so flawless. It is technically a bronzer, but it, it definitely works as a highlighter for most people. Um, it is so pretty and it's subtle, but it gives you that glow. I have it on today. This would be a great one for a lot of different people. Um, I have used this one forever and I've barely made a dent in it. It's flattened a little bit at the top, but this will last you forever. And it's a really good affordable option from the drugstore. So all year round. Okay, let's talk about some blushes. I have two because I wanted to cover um, like a variety of skin tones. So the first one I have is Clinique's Cheek Pop in Nude Pop, you guys. This is pretty new to me. I started wearing it in the spring. I've worn it all through the summer. I have it on today. And I will continue to wear this fall, winter, what have you, because it is just the perfect nude pop. It is so pretty and I do think this is probably a color that's going to be more flattering on light to medium skin tones because I do think this will probably show up best on a lighter to medium skin tones because it is, it does have, you know, more of a subtle sort of nude color. Mm -hmm. But what I love about it is that it just looks natural. I'm wearing it now, like I said, in the summer, but in the winter it still just gives you that little bit of a healthy glow to the cheeks. I can't get enough of this. I have not had it for that long and I've already almost completely like uh, rubbed down the flower, which is pretty hard to do if you have any of these. I have two other ones that I haven't even made a dent in the flower on and I feel like I've used those a lot as well too. So. I love this. If you are in the light to medium skin tone range, I definitely, definitely suggest picking it up. If you are any skin tone color, Milani's Luminoso, oh my gosh. I know, again, some people might think, oh, that looks more like a spring-summer color, but I really wear this year-round. It's got a little bit of warmth to it, and I think that makes it wearable in the fall and winter months as well. It just gives you the prettiest glow to the cheeks. It's just, oh my gosh. I really do. I wear this a lot in the fall. So pretty. I love it, you guys. And again, it's an affordable option from the drugstore. These stick around all day. They're a great formula, and I totally recommend picking them up. So a palette that I think will work for anyone and everyone year-round is the Too Faced Natural Matte Palette. It's what I'm wearing today. The reason I picked this one is because, well, I mean, look at it. Hold it up. Now the reason that I love this so much for year-round purposes is because you really can just like use the same shadows but apply them in a different manner to get like season appropriate looks. This is such an amazing palette. It is one of my all-time favorites. I've talked about it several times but um, I think I just think you can make it work year-round. It's in a nice tin case so you can travel with it. I love it. I love it. If I didn't tell you that, I, I really love it. The other eyeshadow that I picked is a bit of a splurge, but I think it's worth the money because you can make it work all year round. This is the Giorgio Armani Eye Tint in the color Rose Ash. Now, when I first bought it, I was like, hmm, fall perhaps. It definitely has like a bronzy kind of rosy tone. You guys, I have been wearing this so much in the spring and summer months because it has that like glowy effect. It looks so beautiful on your eyes. It has the most beautiful iridescence and when the light catches your eyes, it just they just glow. It enhances your eye color. I'm like I'm so passionate about this, you guys. I just love it and I know it will continue to work for the fall and winter months. If you're looking to splurge on something that you can use alone or just, you know, you could put a matte color in the crease. I've done both lots of times. I'll just kind of sweep this up into my crease as well. This is so, so beautiful. The formula is amazing. I love it. Lip colors and then my fragrance. So the first lip color I have, absolute favorite lip color of life. I wear it all year round. I think this is my third or fourth tube of this. It's Max Creme Cup. It's so beautiful. Just a perfect pinky nude. I know a ton of people um, that have also purchased this and love it. I think it's flattering on a ton of different skin tones. It's just beautiful. I don't know what else to say about it. It works. It's so it's so good. The other one that I have is the NYX Butter Gloss in Creme Brulee. Now, this is again just another beautiful pinky nude color and it's just a gloss option. It's also a drugstore option. So it looks, oh god, I love this color. I kind of want to, hang on, I want to apply. Oh yes, they look beautiful together. Mm. God, just smear that on. 
So either one of these, I think, no matter your skin color, your skin color or the time of year, you're golden. Okay, so like I said, we each wanted to also include a fragrance. So my fragrance is. Hakator by Givenchy. I don't know how you say that, but um, this smells amazing. During the winter months, I wanted a new perfume. I wasn't sure what to get, and my sister's like, just get this one, you will love it. I didn't even smell it. I just trusted her recommendation. I ordered it, and I love it. I mean, I'll put the notes below because I don't know how to describe it other than it's just delicious. It's It's got a little bit of sweetness, but it also has that florally scent. Oh, there's something really just like flirty and fun about it, but I really, I wore it when I ordered it in the winter all year long, and I've been reaching for this one and also my um, Estee Lauder Bronze Goddess, just kind of back and forth alternating them through the summer. It's so good. Okay guys, so those are my top 10 year-round beauty products. Please head over to Melanie's channel, subscribe, watch her video, tell her I said hey, show her all the love in the world because she deserves it. Um, and let me know in the comments below what some of your favorite all year round products are. I love hearing from you guys. So take care of each other and I'll see you soon. Bye guys.